I think that uh, helping match uh, cities, you know, goals with the startup's roadmap and, and providing that uh, you know, mutual visibility is extremely helpful to both parties. I was pretty intrigued about the identity verification you know, product and space. Uh, obviously has you know, huge application and relevance for financial services. When they bring me a company, I know that it's already been vetted, I know that it's got value, and so um, I take the time to meet with that company. And not only do I take the time, I ensure my, my product team meets with that company. Experts say that cybercrime in general by 2025 will be a $10.5 trillion industry. It's a massive number, and it's a, and a number that eclipses all of uh, drug trafficking combined. We do somewhere in the neighborhood 600 million transactions a month on cards only, so it's for a bank like Citi, the volume is immense. Identity theft, synthetic ID fraud was drastically increasing. And so we felt this was a, a problem worth, you know, going and spending the next 10, 20 years of our life working on. Identities are so multidimensional. You have PII, name, email, phone address, date of birth, social IP, device. You have physical documents, you have your face. So here's the market leading identity verification, fraud prevention, and anti-money laundering solution uh, here in the US market. Uh, we've developed an end-to-end -end platform verifying every element, every dimension of a consumer's identity with the highest degree of coverage and the uh, uh, best classification accuracy of, of anyone in the market. Uh, that obviously helps our customers say yes to more good people programmatically uh, while safely managing uh, uh, the fraud number. Customers want strong protection upfront, but they want it seamlessly. So when a customer or a potential customer onboards and is doing the application process, they want it to be easy and painless, but at the same time, both they and us want to make sure that it's secure. Now with applications shifting to digital, the risk of financial crime and fraud are accentuated, but also because of the competitive nature and, and stakes with you know, fintechs and, and other banks competing you know, fiercely for consumers, the, the cost of a false uh, positive because we think it's a fraudster is, is big. So getting identity verification right is of crucial importance. I was able to develop a relationship with the commercial side, folks running analytics, folks running fraud. We did uh, proof of concepts to see what it looked like, what kind of fraud rates we saw. And that's where we first identified uh, the beauty of the product. It, it, it actually is a fraud differentiator for us. It's actually doing a better job up front in the application space, finding the bad guys and not impacting as many customers. We're looking for companies that are constantly evolving and adapting their product to the changing face of fraud. We have confidence they'll be good tomorrow because they continue to evolve their product in the application space. Then we wanna work with them to understand how else uh, we can involve their product in uh, the customer life cycle. Well, upon getting you know, that signal, uh, it was it was clear that I should jump on the on the investment. Startups have no trouble finding banks that they wanna that wanna do business with them, um, and the reality is that business ultimately is personal. Now, and I'll tell a kind of qu quick quick fun story. I went in for a meeting uh, with Luis in his office. Uh, just that day, we had signed the agreement with the the other issuer, uh, and so. You know, Luis had his assistant bring us in a couple of champagne flutes and, and, and a bottle of Moet to celebrate uh, us signing this other issuer, right? We did no business with City at the time. Um, uh, uh, we had no commercial relationship at that time. He was just kind of celebrating our success, um, you know, as if he was, you know, sharing it with us. There are multiple areas in which we can be very helpful to our uh, portfolio companies, introducing them. Uh, to a variety of uh, parties that could be helpful to their journey. Giving us pitch days, bringing us kind of spotlight days where we can tell our narrative to uh, different executives uh, that, that, that obviously uh, are very interested in the problems that, that we can help them solve. So the City Ventures team has been amazing in not only internal city relationships as we're looking to develop uh, um, uh, a deeper commercial partnership with the bank, 
but also externally, they're deeply tapped into the FinTech network, e-commerce, uh, uh, just the broader technology community, and they've just been a, a really amazing partner to us and helping us develop uh, a really critical relationships here at Secure.